Rice weevils are tiny pantry pests that infest and feed on stored food products. Households that often purchase grains are likely to deal with rice weevils eventually, if not currently. While a single bug may not be much to worry about, a rice weevil population can quickly boom to a large scale and cause hundreds of dollars in food damage. So in this video, we'll show you how to identify and treat for rice weevils so your home can remain free of these pantry pests. To shop for the products featured in this video and learn even more about rice weevil control, click the icon on the top right of the screen or click the link in the description below. The first thing you should do in any pest control plan is identify what exactly you're dealing with. Careless identification can lead to wrong treatment methods, costing you time and money. Even though they're called rice weevils, they don't exclusively feed on and harbor in rice. They can also be found in other grains, cereals, and dry pasta. Rice weevils are smaller than even grains of rice, growing only to be as large as 3 to 4.6 millimeters in length. They have dark brown bodies, and you may even notice some lighter brown patches if you can see them close up enough. You can tell a weevil apart from other pests like grain beetles because you'll notice the weevil's long snout. It's hard to miss, even if they're that small. You'll most likely only spot adult rice weevils rather than any eggs, larvae, or pupae. After mating, a female weevil will deposit one egg into one grain, seal up whatever holes she's made, and then move on to the next grain. She'll repeat this process until she has laid about 300 to 400 eggs. Though only half of all rice weevil eggs hatch, this is how a large-scale infestation can easily occur. Inspection is the next phase of any good pest control plan. Once you know what your pests look like, check around your property to confirm their presence or find hot spots of activity. To confirm rice weevil activity, look in or around your pantry or where food stuff is stored. You may see a few rice weevils wandering the shelves, but focus on finding the source of your infestation. Look for adult weevils inside bags or boxes of grains or other stored foods. Remember, since rice weevils spend their development stages within grains, you'll only see adults during your inspection. Be sure to also check any cupboards, drawers, and shelving. If you're wondering how you got rice weevils in the first place, the most likely reason is that you bought infested food from the grocery store and then brought them in. Most of the time, that bag of flour or rice you just bought was harboring these pests. Even if you didn't see the adults crawling around, the eggs and larvae could be in there going unnoticed. After identifying your pests and inspecting for activity on your property, it's time to start treatment. Before starting any treatment, be sure to wear your personal protective equipment or PPE. And remember to keep all people and pets off the treated areas until dry. Before starting your treatment, you need to clear out your pantry. Start by throwing out all boxed and bagged foodstuffs. That sounds excessive, but if you found at least one infested package, odds are there are rice weevils in your other packaged foods. Weevils can chew through packaging materials like cardboard or thin cereal bags, which allows them to easily spread throughout an entire pantry. Once these foods are tossed, proceed to remove and set aside everything else. Next, vacuum all cracks and crevices in the pantry shelving or cabinets. If your shelving is adjustable, clean out the peg holes with a toothpick and vacuum. Rice weevils may be found in these tight spaces as they travel from place to place. Be sure to throw out the vacuum's bag or clean the canister when you're done. Then wipe down the pantry shelves with water to clean up any food residue. Do not use any strong cleaners or bleach, as these might keep the pests away from pesticides you'll soon apply. Once you've totally cleared and cleaned out your pantry, you'll need to use insecticide aerosols labeled for rice weevils like Pyrid and Novicide. Pyrid is an insecticide aerosol that's often used as a flushing agent, and it's great to treat tight cracks and crevices where rice weevils and other pests may be hiding. To use Pyrid as a crack and crevice treatment, just remove the white applicator, attach the provided red applicator, and make sure that the straw is firmly affixed in the spout. Shake the can and spray along the length of any cracks and crevices in your pantry where rice weevils could be hiding. When treating cracks and crevices, you just want to spray in quick bursts, usually about one second of spray per foot. Pyrid does not leave a residual, but it's an excellent contact spray with a powerful knockdown and a quick kill. Next, apply Novicide. Novicide is another aerosol insecticide, but this one contains an insect growth regulator, or IGR. An IGR will disrupt the target pest's life cycle. Novicide in particular has a long-lasting residual and will work for up to seven months once applied. We recommend you apply Novicide as a spot treatment along the edges of your shelves. Just shake the can, hold it upside down, and spray in quick bursts every couple of inches. With both products, you'll be able to kill any rice weevils you've spotted and protect your pantry against stragglers or future potential infestations. Be sure to only spray these products in an empty pantry. Allow your treatments to dry before moving on to the next step or before you restock your shelves. 
Prevention is essential to keeping pests in check. Even after you've applied pesticides, the best way to stop pest activity is to make sure it can't happen again. While Novacide's long residual and insect growth regulator will protect your pantry for up to seven months, employ these other tips to prevent infestations in the future. If you can, buy only about a week or two's worth of food at a time. Try not to overstock your pantry shelves because the longer something sits there, the more likely a potential infestation could break out. When buying dry foods at the grocery store, take a look at the packaging. If you can see the product, try to look for any rice weevils or other pests. If you see any holes, rips, tears, or other openings, then it's an obvious indicator to pass that item up. And when storing food, it's best to keep it in tight-fitting or sealed containers. Put cereals, rice, and flour in containers that can be air-sealed. Even plastic Tupperware can help. This is especially true for dry pet food. Pet food and bird seed are often overlooked and extremely conducive for pantry pests, so it's important to store your pet food in a sealed container. Rice weevils are small, yet destructive pantry pests that can cost hundreds in food damage, but there are ways to control infestation that's gone out of hand. With these professional products and tips from Solutions Pest and Lawn, you can stop rice weevils from infesting your home, and we offer same-day shipping to help you get control quickly. Visit our website to get your products today. If you like this how-to guide, please share. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe for more how-to and product videos, and contact us for more tips, tricks, and DIY pest solutions.